towards first graders, um, learning about the who, or the five W's, which are who, what, and where, and why, um, when you're reading content. Um, intending learning outcomes is identify the five detail words. Um, associate the detail with correct words and use skills to write your own story. Um, to begin, is the five W's, which um, are who is a person, what is a thing, when is a time, um, where is a place, and why is a reason. Um, I put these up here so that way you guys as my first graders um, would know the definitions of each of them. Um, a graphic to use to help remember is the five fingers, um, who, what, when, where, and why. And if I have a volunteer who would come and fill this out, somebody. Yeah, okay, no. <laughs> I'm just a little bit more practice. Um, basically, you drag your diamond to where you think it should go. So, do I have another volunteer? Please? Yeah, it's not hard. <laughs> okay, so you take your diamond and you drag it to the correct shape. And then if it's wrong, it'll spit it back out. So, you got passage and complete the graphic with the details on the next page. Um, so Granddad asked Jaron and Jonathan, or Jonathan was his to help with the yard work. They are cleaning up the fallen leaves. After they make a large pile with the rake, they jump in the leaf pile to have fun. Then they will pick up the pile and put the leaves in bags. Um, so typically if you guys are my students, I'd probably have you write this down so that way you don't forget it because I'm going to go to the next slide. Um, so, if I could have a volunteer who who asked the children to help with the work? Does anyone want to fill in that bubble? <laughs> What do the children use to make the leaf pile? Does someone else want to come fill out that bubble? Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, what do Jaron and Jonathan jump in, or why do they jump into the leaf? Oh. 
Where do Granddad and the children, or where are they working? I'll fill that one out for you guys. In the yard. And then, um, when does the story take place? Obviously, it's fall. <laughs> All right, um, as a class, um, you should use the five W's to make up a story about the picture, and then use um, the pen. Um, my presentation's kind of long, so I'm going to skip this part, um, but typically you would just kind of look at the picture and um, write a nice little story. Um, something I learned, which I'm helping out, um, is to generate, <coughs> to like make a group. Um, so after the groups are formed from the generator, answer the questions from the video on the next page. Um, so typically I fill it out with your guys' names and then I would click generate. And then I have my two groups. Um, and then with the video on the next page, um, here it is. So I'll play that real quick. Those are the five W's. We are going to listen to a nursery rhyme. When it is done, you can answer the five W's. <laughs>